What's cracking, y'all? You are now watching Boo TV. Appreciate you for stopping in. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay notified, and let's get into the topic for today. What up, y'all? Found this video from a YouTube channel called Golden Hoops, the NBA strongest dunk moments. Now, this video is only nine minutes long, so I know it's not going to cover nearly all the super strong dunks in the NBA because we have a very long history with a lot of powerful dunkers and powerful dunks that we've seen. But I'm curious to see the ones that they put out. I feel like it's going to be mostly a nod to the NBA within the last 10 to 15 years with some iconic, well-known dunks from players like Michael Jordan, Sean Kemp, Dominique Wilkins, Shaquille O'Neal from back in the day. But I feel like outside of those, you know, popular dunks, we'll get a lot of more recent NBA dunks. But um, let's get into it. I am a fan of Golden Hoops. Had great use of the dribble to get the look you want. DeMar DeRozan! Gerald Green, look at the explosion. That's insane. He can jump out the gym. What trampoline? We shoot 38% from the downtown. Here comes Al B.J. <laughs> look out! Oh, the crowd on their feet. That's what they came to see. Boy left wide open. Griffin, oh, wow! Incredible rebound. After Jones Jr. gets into the paint, look out below! What a finish. That got Chris Bosch to jump right out of James Johnson with four to shoot, drives in, what a dunk! Johnson going kung fu on you know who. Wow, seven straight points for the Heat. That's away from Raymond Felt. Glad they put that dunk there. It's super underrated dunk in the history of the league. Joel. Last game, Dennis Scott was starting. Bowie was coming off the bench as Bowie oh. follows it almost and does bring down the entire oh. back. Westbrook chick. Westbrook elevating the two-handed sledgehammer. I'll tell you the most impressive thing about that dunk is that he got the ball on the other side of the court and practically outran everybody with the ball the length of the court and finished it. I'll never forget that dunk. The Wolves up by two. Wiggins. Oh, my. A resounding smash by Wiggins. Oh, boy. Here comes Chandler in three on one. Left wing. Left shot. Slam dunk. Gallinari, what are you doing? Get out of the First basket of the quarter. Flops. Oh, Collins with one hand. Oh, it's Xavier Henry. Xavier Henry, I remember that. Davies 
wrong place. LeBron sees a crowd. He turns the corner and just bullets in a powerful. That was powerful. Hawk slam jam. Oh, LeBron James. Johnson. I remember this one. Terrence Ross going right in. Terrence Ross just did that. I'm wondering if they're going to have that Dwayne Wade dunk in there. That would have been a travesty. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shouldn't even be on here. There's a handful of dunks I didn't think were very strong. I don't think that should have been on here. Three on one. <laughs> it down. Quick pass. What a pass. Oh, and he trapped the 
And Aaron Bain, quick click. Welcome to your Kodak moment. He has to make another video of this because I think probably half of these dunks didn't even deserve to be on this list. Even the Kobe, the Kobe Bryant dunk on Ben Wallace in his rookie year, I don't think that should have been on there. Kobe on Dwight, okay, I, one of the most powerful Kobe dunks I've ever seen is actually he did this dunk against the Hornets where he came baseline, double clutch, reversed it, didn't even look at the basket barely, and he slammed that joint so hard all you could hear was the rim it, and the ball just bounced into the bleachers. That was one of the most powerful Kobe Bryant dunks I've ever seen. That wasn't on the list. Um, I was like, they better have Dwayne Wade up there. Josh Smith. Josh Smith has a ton of strong, powerful dunks. He wasn't on a single one of these highlights. Tracy McGrady has. Vince Carter wasn't on a single highlight. He wasn't. And the one that showed from Gerald Green, that wasn't even his strongest dunk. He had some nasty alley oop and windmill dunks that were powerful as hell that should have been up there. LeBron had some other dunks that should have been up there besides the ones that they put up there. Michael Jordan wasn't up there. Sean Kemp wasn't up there. Dominique Wilkins wasn't up there. And they had some other weak-ass dunks in there. But I said that was going to happen. Well, actually, it was worse. I said they might have some popular callback dunks from older eras, but they really didn't. They didn't have any. I'm glad they put that Gerald Green dunk in there. That is a hidden gem. I actually reacted to that one in my Amazing Plays playlist because that dunk is highly underrated. But, yeah, I've seen... I've seen better ones from Kawhi Leonard than the ones they put up there. So I don't know. And actually, one of Dwayne Wade's dunks was probably just as powerful as a dunk on uh, Anderson Varejao was when he's with the Heatles and he comes baseline, spins, and then tomahawks it with two hands, but finishes just slightly with one, but it's one of the nastiest dunks I've ever seen. Two-handed cockback off a spin. Man, they tripping. Anyway, y'all let me know what you think about it. If you got any dunks that you feel like deserve to be in this uh, in this video, let me know in the comment section. Drop a link if you can find it as well. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay notified, and I'll catch you on the next one. We out, baby.